So, the other group we met, I think they're stuck for lunch because the stove is on. So we're gonna make plain shit as bad. Yeah, I'm gonna scare them. Are, are you ninja as well? Yes, I'm, we're gonna go on reconnaissance, check out what they're doing, and then come back, contact the group, tell them that they're just eating and <laughs> doing crack. <laughs> we're gonna scare them. <laughs> what happened, Jeff? Were you a little what? nervous? <laughs> no, they said that they saw someone, so I was like... What? Yeah. They're camouflaged. That's impossible. Well, you guys weren't really that well camouflaged now, were you? What happened? Were you afraid? What, what happened? I thought somebody was hurt. <laughs> it was supposed to be a bear call. You replied when we replied, so it sounded like a human. We clearly heard Falling for help. Hello. Should I do that? That was yeah, you that guys. Was Sarah saying, <laughs> you guys said hello. Well, Sarah, yeah, you do the worst bear someone. call ever. Oh, like, do, was, your, do your bear call. I can't. I can't. That was a one time only thing. No, it was like a bear going through puberty. <laughs> No, I was worried. It was a moose. And it was that, supposed that to be a scared moose. you? I yes, I thought somebody was actually hurt because of the helicopter and stuff. It's like we found the person. Did you think the helicopter was looking for someone that we knew as well? I there was a part of me that was a little convinced that they might have been looking for the other group that went up to Pincer Lake, just because we kind of saw them fly off in that direction last night. But uh, yeah, I haven't heard anything other than what you just told me, so. We're good. They're again, just looking for someone else that is in danger, but not our group, so we're okay. <laughs> All right, so there's this guy who was camping out on the lake over here last night and just sitting down, uh, drinking some coffee, having a nice peaceful uh, time. And the helicopter came down and just shone the spotlight right on him and to see if he was the missing person that we might think might be out there and he looked at them and just started going. What does that mean? To let them know that he's okay and... So is that a signal? Yes it is. This means that, if you, that you're okay. And uh, yeah, they took off after that spraying him with water with the helicopter <laughs> and his entire campsite. So they're looking for someone. Yeah. 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 Well, you sure you don't have a garop in here? Not here. Uh, how how did you make out? Oh, buddy. Yeah. Solid. Did your beard's oh, shorter. Buddy. Did you burn it? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> just adds ruggedness, right? Check out his hair. Check out his hair. Oh, yeah, I just sprayed it. Yeah, you take your hat off. You've become a bushman. <laughs> yeah, originally in the back, but it's more convenient up front. So. We've also determined that Sean. God, oh, that's amazing! Look at that. Tell he doesn't want to be part oh, of that. Yeah. <laughs> no. Do you have a Viking helmet as well? Oh yeah. Yeah, back at home somewhere. Morning, sure. <laughs> we like to keep this group in style, you know. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, what was that? Oh, having the helicopter come around. Yeah. Uh, well, having the helicopter come around a few times and really <laughs> hearing a motor in any motor at all, it just takes happen. away the wilderness yeah. setting, like. It's a vibe, actually, that I look for when I come out here. And that helicopter just totally took me out of that space. Just... No, it just it took... Detached me from the wilderness because it brought me back to civilization, feeling that there's things watching. It kind of felt like Big Brother was watching. <laughs> yeah.
you okay? Thanks a lot.